Hey everybody, thanks for coming by. We've got a couple of really cool hacks I'm going to show you today. Here, um, we're going to show you how to add an image to your order bump, as well as default shipping for just the United States, and to make it disappear so your customers don't need to enter it. So let's go to the screen. Here you can see we got a pretty basic setup for a funnel that I've been working on. So on the second page of the two-step order form where you see the order bump that looks like a pretty generic text for the order bump it's pretty standard and exactly the way your your order bump is typically typically going uh, to look as soon as it's added of course this is all the default text and it hasn't been customized yet but we're going to make it look just a little bit nicer here so what i want to do is i'm going to add an image And I've already got my image uploaded, but if you don't have it, upload it. Otherwise, select it. This is the order bump for this particular funnel. A nice little nail care kit here. Although, that's not going to do being there. So, the first thing that you need to do is you need to head on over to cfprotools.com. And when you, uh, when you log in, you're going to come to the screen that looks just like this. And you're going to come up to free add-ons. And you're going to scroll all the way down toward the bottom. And you're looking for CF bump image. We're going to copy this little snippet of code. For now, you can just never mind that video. And we're going to head on over to settings, tracking code, footer code. And we're going to paste that bad boy right there. We're going to grab this little snippet here that says bump image. Copy it. Close that window. And now there's another mysterious tab. A lot of you don't know what is for uh, down on the bottom here when you click on the settings for this. It's going to be this, uh, the pound or the hashtag sign. This is the CSS info, uh, cascading style sheets. It's going to kind of control the uh, the form and function, uh, the layouts and, and all that within these pages. So we're just going to paste bump dash image right in here. You can type it in if you want, hit update. And now... All of the magic should be ready to go. We're just going to save and preview. And, and you'll see that everything fills in. But man, this country is really annoying to have to select that every time. But here we are. Boom. Image on the order bump. What do you think that that's going to do to conversions when people can see exactly what it is that they're going to be getting in addition to the description? I'll tell you, it's going to raise conversions. People are visual. They love to see what they're getting. You have nice, clear image here. Um, give them something that looks nice with a nice description, and your order bumps are going to go crazy. Now, let's go take care of that shipping problem, shall we? CF Pro Tools, I'm going to have the solution for that too. CF Pro Tools, by the way, uh, this group of tools that I'm using right now is free. Uh, they do have a paid section, their VIP club. Um, but we're going to be looking for CF USA only shipping hidden. Now, this only works if the stuff that you're shipping is only shipping within the United States. You don't want any option but the United States to be selected. Um, it'll default to that and it'll hide so it can't be changed. So we're just going to take this top section of code here between the script and the slash and the, and the script opening and the script closing tags and we're going to copy that and we're going to go back to our tracking code back to the footer code and we're going to paste that right below the old one close that back to the cf pro tools window and this little extra snippet of of code here that we missed we're going to now grab that one the style and opening and closing tags and this is going to go into our settings and custom css area so we're actually making a, a little change to the style sheet here and then we're going to save that off and now when we preview bam gone defaulted so it worked we have our order bump. I mean, we are on our way to a nice, uh, easy-to-use, high-converting funnel. So I hope that helps you guys out. 
take some value from that. You don't forget to like and subscribe if you're watching on YouTube. Leave a reaction and comment if you and uh, <coughs> if you are watching on Facebook. And uh, don't forget to check out the group. I will talk to you guys later.